Hey, so merch is here, Canada only. And if you guys want to support this channel and if you like what we do here, then be sure to hit subscribe and check out the link that I'll put down below. I think it's really cool, really simple, and it goes well in any color. Now let's get into today's video. So how about you make your favorite drink as shown by a lot of you in this poll here, your cafe mocha at home, which might be, yes, it will be better than Starbucks and much cheaper too. So I'm gonna show you the way I love to make it. And this is gonna be a really convenient and a really approachable recipe for a lot of you who might not have a fancy taste in coffee, who might not have a fancy coffee grinder, no coffee machine, so you can't brew homemade coffee either. All thanks to Javi and my method to prepare this over the stove top. And if you want, you can make it in the microwave as well. And if you want to get a 15% discount off of your first purchase of Javi coffee, be sure to enter the discount code ANADI when you are at the checkout screen. And it's gonna be really convenient for all of you who use coffee every day for their daily beverage, their daily dose of caffeine or desserts. It's gonna save a lot of time for you. And I really like it. And if you can make it this good at home, Starbucks just becomes a luxury which you might enjoy once in a while while you get to enjoy your own mocha which is better at home whenever you want. Isn't that better? So in my pot here, I'm heating up some milk. Now you can make it with half milk, half water, go full milk. This is just 2% milk that I'm using here and we just want it to come up to a simmer. Now get your favorite instant coffee. I'm using the Tim Hortons version and I really like it because it has hints of chocolatey notes. At least I taste that. So when the milk has come up to a simmer, then add in your instant coffee and then your cocoa powder as well. Now let's say you already have a coffee machine and you like your favorite brewed coffee, you have a favorite brand, then just cut the amount of milk by half and then replace that with your favorite brewed coffee. Put it all in the pot and let that come into a simmer and once it does, add in some cocoa powder in it. Now I mentioned this recipe was approachable and convenient. And that's because some people like their mocha with a punch of that bitter, strong coffee flavor. But some like it chocolatey. That's how I like it. So if there are people like that, then Javi coffee comes into play. Just add in a teaspoon or two of this concentrated brewed coffee, which is so convenient just to have already ready in your fridge. So it doesn't matter if you have a coffee machine, coffee grinder, you have good quality, great quality coffee just lying in your fridge, concentrated. So you only need a teaspoon at a time for each drink, for each serving. So along with my instant coffee, I'm gonna add in a couple of teaspoons of Javi to really add that punch to this drink. And it'll really complement the sweetness and the chocolatiness of the mocha. You also want to sweeten it according to your tastes. I'm using sugar and just mix it well, give it a quick taste and make sure it's as sweet as you like it. You can even use honey, agave, maple, or whatever other sweetener you prefer. And as soon as it's all mixed well and it's warmed through, you're ready to serve this. Now to serve it, to make it special, I have some of my homemade whipped cream. I'll put the full recipe down below, but it's just heavy cream whipped up with some powdered sugar and vanilla extract until you get some soft peaks. Add that right over that hot mocha and it's just gonna blend and melt into your coffee. It's gonna be so good with an additional topping of my mocha chocolate sauce. To make this is very easy. All you need to do is heat up some heavy cream and chocolate chips in a saucepan until it has melted completely and then season it with the Javi coffee which you already have in the fridge because you used the discount code ANADI 
to get you 15% off from the website. I'll put that link down below. So just add a couple of teaspoons into that chocolate cream concoction and turn this into a delicious coffee chocolate mocha sauce. And your mocha is ready. It's so simple. It's so approachable. And if you're really out of time, let's say you have five minutes before your meeting and you already have the cream in the fridge, you already have the chocolate sauce in the fridge because you were smart and you prepared, then heat up your milk in the microwave and in the meanwhile, put your coffee, sweetener, cocoa powder in a cup. Add the hot milk a bit at a time while mixing thoroughly and then top with your cream and chocolate sauce or do without it. Whatever you like, it's your drink. Winter is coming. You wanna keep warm, you wanna be cozy, you want a good drink. So I hope you guys like this really simple recipe, which is gonna be your go-to drink, hopefully, this winter season. For more videos just like this one, be sure to hit subscribe, hit the bell icon, and for all my viewers in Canada, if you like what we do here, if you want to support this channel, then be sure to check out the merch in the description box down below. I'll see you guys again on the next one. Bye guys.